to welcome back guys so uh, today I'm going to uh, show you guys the tutorial on how to use your uh, Galaxy uh, smartwatch as a pointed device okay so first of all you need to uh, let's see go to the menu and then you want to go to uh, this uh, PPT control controller and then it says uh, to get started tap connect then go to the Bluetooth setting on your computer to pair it with your uh, watch okay So I'm going to go to my computer, so I'm going to, hold on a second. So I'm going to go to my uh, Bluetooth right now and open the Bluetooth preference on my uh, MacBook so I'm gonna hit connect and then uh, you have about five minutes to uh, connect with your uh, watch so now you gotta go to your computer right now make sure it, your smart watch is uh, popping up Because my watch is currently connecting with my uh, Android, hopefully I don't need to disconnect it. So I guess not. It says uh, Galaxy watch over there. I don't know. It take about about a minute or so, uh, less than a minute. So I click click on connect on the computer. Let's see what's it doing on the watch on the now it says connected and then on the computer it show me the code and then I'm just click on check to connect it there you go so it says it's connected to whatever device See, so click on touchpad, move your finger on the screen to control the cursor on your computer. Let's see if it works. Oh my god, it works! <laughs> wow, this is tight. Let me see if I could close this uh, keyboard assistance. Do I just tap it? Oh my god, it works like charm. So I'm not sure if uh, Apple Watch uh, Series 4 could do that or not. So I'm using uh, this is a MacBook Air and I could control it right now as a mouse uh, cursor. Let me close the Bluetooth. Wow, this, this is pretty awesome. Well, of course, uh, if you do that, it's going to eat up your battery so let me open a web page uh, real quick because some of my wife are up upgraded google chrome and uh, having a problem or something so i'm not sure if I could, you could type or not no you cannot type just uh, as a mouse uh, cursor only. So you gotta go on your keyboard. Let's 
go to a Supreme uh, job today because uh, I was uh, try to use this computer and somehow it was uh, so slow. Huh. So I guess it's working fine now. It's just weird. So again, I can use my cursor on my watch. I mean, touchpad. And then uh, click on shop. There you go. So in case uh, you are tired of uh, using your touchpad, you can just uh, use your watch as a touchpad. This is uh, pretty awesome. It's a good, awesome gadget. Check out the uh, champion uh, jacket right now and see. As you can see right now, all the jackets are sold out. The green one, Kelly green, you got the red, you got the black, sold out. So you can zoom in, zoom out with the watch by clicking on the picture. So I wonder if I hit back, what's gonna happen? Oh, so I'm not sure what's a slideshow. Click on the three button. Screen always on, so you want to have a screen always on when you're using as a mouse uh, pad. Oh, tracking device, wrap up alert, interval alert, connect new computer. So those are the options that you could do. Let me see what's interval alert. So you can set it like an interval alert, like how many minutes, 20, what is that? Well, up to 60 minutes. So you get increment of five minutes at a time. So let's leave it at uh, 10 minutes. Let's click on, oh, slideshow. I can record slideshow. No way. Okay, I'm gonna demonstrate the slideshow about this uh, left and right arrow. Imagine if you have a presentation or anything like that. And then, uh, or uh, if you have a PowerPoint, you can do the slideshow by click on the arrow. So if you press it, whoop, went to the sleep mode, what the? When you press it, the picture is gonna jump either uh, back or uh, forward, okay, or the next uh, picture. So this is uh, pretty awesome. When you're doing like a presentation and then you don't need to have a pointing device and you just use your watch for your presentation. And then if you want touchpad, you can move around the cursor around, all right? to show them, oh, what the heck? What was that? So yeah, this is a... Uh... I'm not sure what the fingerprint gesture is but uh, or you can use a bezel to go up and down So I could um, touch it and then drag or something, see. Yeah, 
Yeah, you gotta do it twice. You can touch it and then drag the picture to somewhere else, but uh, I don't need to drag anything. So if you want, you can touch it and then hold and then drag to whatever uh, photo you want, I guess. So. So again, I'm going to go back and then I could use uh, under the slide, I could change the picture. Okay. I'll go back. So just to uh, show you guys uh, the slideshow button for this, but uh, the only problem is I'm not sure why it's a recording. I click on slide, slideshow, and then it start recording, but I'm not sure what's it for. I might have to go to my folder and find out what's the recording about. You touch it, stop recording, okay? Slideshow. See if it's still working. Yeah, it still works. So uh, let's go and then. Uh, I don't think I can scroll with two fingers to cry. Oops. Let me go back there and check out the, if I can use it to scroll down by two fingers like the apple. Nope. So unfortunately, you cannot uh, do the hand uh, finger gesture to scroll up and down. You had to use the line right there on the corner and just uh, click on it in order to scroll uh, up or down. Okay. So yeah, this is uh, pretty awesome in case uh, you are hooking up with your computer and watching TV and you not need a computer, you could uh, scroll around like a wireless mouse, you know, that's uh, pretty awesome. So I'm glad I got this watch uh, for, from uh, this year drop. Actually, this is my first uh, smartwatch, and I'm so happy with it. Now I'm wearing this like uh, every day unless I had to charge it. And then uh, my Tech Hoyer is on the watch case. So anyway, hopefully uh, you guys uh, give a thumbs up and then uh, like the video. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and then uh, turn on the bell for notification. So whenever I drop new and latest video, you guys will not miss out. All right. So I think I'm the only one that is doing this uh, tutorial on YouTube. Please uh, share this with your friends or family. If they got this watch and they would like to know the, the touchpad on this uh, setup. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Like always, peace.